<laughs> wow, hello, wait, what the fuck are you doing? Hey! Be normal. <laughs> <laughs> Alright, guys, as you can see today, Steph is here, and I actually recorded something in his place. Let me just light my cigarette, because I need a cigarette. And I'll probably be coughing because I have a bad throat. Yes, I don't need to smoke. Well, I do need to smoke, but I shouldn't. Oh, I'll just smoke. <laughs> but what I wanted to talk to you guys about is friendship. It's a very simple concept for me. Steph, what is friendship to you? Let's friendship hear your explanation first. Friendship to me is... Um Friends who stand for each other and who do everything for, <coughs> for, for. So basically, have each other's back. Yes, yes, yes. Yeah. And all right, what friendship is to me? It's a little more in depth, a little bit more complicated, but that's because my English is better. Shh. Don't be offended, Steph. I'm sorry. I suck in English, and you know that. You know that. <laughs> Dude, you suck at something else. Ah, oh, fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> hey, you need to bleep that out, all those swear words. Just cool. saying. No s oh, wait, I did swear on my voice. Never mind, he can keep the swear words in. <laughs> but yeah, my explanation to what friendship is. Friendship starts off as getting to know people. And there has never been a moment in human history, in my opinion, that two people, for instance, walk across each other on the street, Look each other in the eye. You're gonna be my best friend. You are gonna. You no. You're gonna be my. No. That shit doesn't happen. I think friends must be have. Uh, who's he? Friends must be able to have a fight. Yes. Yes. Because when you know have to, when you don't have fight in a friendship, you're, if I think then you're not a friend from. Because friends have to make fights with each other. Hey, just saying. A friend, ask where the refrigerator is. Your best friend just dives in there and steals all your food. <laughs> yeah. But yeah. anyway, guys, I think the, the main part is getting to know people. And once you get to know people, you will feel a connection with them. You will feel a bond or you will feel certain similar interest. And I need to smoke because or else my cigarette will go out. <laughs> and once you have uh, certain interests or a bond that runs deep enough, then you can talk a friendship because that friendship is like well this is gonna sound a little bit cheesy but friendship is like love it needs to develop over time and I think the best way to test a friendship not that I recommend testing friendships because that could backfire on you if the friendship is not strong enough but like for me and Steph for instance I mean I basically tell stuff, dude, I think that's a good idea or I think that's a bad idea. I mean, of course I hope he listens to me because I pretty much know what I'm talking about every now and then. I mean, I can be wrong too, don't get me wrong, but if I feel strongly about something and then I believe I'm right. So, for instance, um, he wanted to do something with a video today. I mean, we our common interest is video making vlogs, YouTube, films, uh, editing, that sort of shit. Our common interest is that. He wanted to record something today. Well, sure, I'll be happy to come over and help you with it. I actually start in the film that he was going to make. We're actually going to edit that pretty soon on my computer. Yeah. <laughs> but he wanted to do a certain thing, and I was like, dude, I don't think that's going to work. So I explained my reasons. And I think that's a good thing to do in a in a in any kind of a relationship, like with your parents, with um, a loved one, uh, girlfriend, boyfriend, friend, best friend, because in essence, you are basically saying, okay, dude, or girl, whatever. I have another opinion, and as long as the friendship is strong enough, you can respect each other's opinions. And sure, Steph does things that I'm like, dude, I should kick your ass for that. But I'm sure he has the same with me. Yeah, dude, sure. So That's that friends. Yeah, I mean, and we're not afraid to tell each other. And of course, friends also make a lot of fun together. I mean, it's that his camera is now on the bed. It's empty. 
But you should have seen the crazy stunts we were pulling when I was cooking dinner for myself. Like, shall we give them a little taste? <laughs> 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 that sort of stuff. I mean, we're just goofballing around. Steph, do you have anything to add? Um, no. No? No. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. Friends, I think um, friends, friend, you don't make friends. Friends come to you. So, you know, I don't know how to translate, but yeah, y you you shouldn't look for friends because yes. friends uh, find each other. Yes, yes. I mean, all right. I'm not done with my video just yet. Let me just explain the story about how me and Steph ended up being friends. When I was living at my previous living place, Steph moved in there. And I disliked him. Because I don't like meeting new people, I'm honest about that. And I am not the... Motherfucker! <laughs> you just spilled on my floor! Just go ahead. Just go ahead. Alright, he just spilled on my floor, but he's a good friend, he's gonna clean it up. <laughs> but yeah, I actually um, disliked him. And the more we talked, I was like, meh, meh, alright, meh, he lives here, meh, okay. But then I was already doing my vlogs and I wanted to take it up to the next level. So I walked over to someone else and I was like, dude, can you help me with my vlogs? I need some sort of video editing program. And he was like, well, you have to ask Steph about that, because he knows quite a lot about that sort of stuff. I was like, okay, so I went to Steph and we sat down. It's like, dude, I do this and this. I want to do this, this and this and this. Can you help me? It's like, well, let me make you a little intro. So he designed an intro for me. I was like, slack jaw. It was a pretty good intro, I have to admit that. And I was like, dude, you want to help me out more often? It's like, yeah, sure, I like doing this. And that's basically how Steph and I ended up being friends, because we had a common interest. And right now, our friendship is at the point where I go to him, he go, comes to me. And it's not just about making films or making movies or YouTube videos. I mean, if I'm in a pickle, I call him. If he's in a pickle, he calls me. I friends, I, 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 you know, I have to tell something. I have to tell something. Mm -hmm. when, when I come to the place where I... Don't be video too long for this. No, that's that's gonna be okay. You just have to suffer through it. <laughs> <laughs> and when I come to that place where he lives, I was like, yeah, there's nobody, there's nobody that comes to me. Cause when I was a new girl <coughs> next door with me, there comes everybody comes to her and everybody's, oh, you're a new girl. My name is this and yeah, my name. Duh, is she's a girl. Yeah, but but you know, but 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 with me that it wasn't. So it mm -hmm. feels very very yeah. I you felt I lonely. Yes, I felt, f but leave it, you know, leave it. But then, when I was um, basically uh, on my own, so to say, uh, coined Wesley to me, and he said he was the first on two people exist. He was the first person that comes to me and said, "Steph, I need you for something." And I was like, "He needs me. Uh, go, go ahead." And he comes with a whole plan, with a whole plan, and I thought, yes, finally, <laughs> someone who, who can I work with, you know? And that's, that feels very, and that's, that is friendship. You, you meet each other, but you don't make each other. Yeah, because, guys, we weren't, like, looking for each other. Yes, yeah, sure, I was looking for a way to better my videos, but I would have just been happy to do it, like, watching tutorials. Although I'm too lazy for that, but... Fate... Well, yeah, I don't know if there's something called fate. I, I don't believe in it personally, I, but you could say fate brought us together. Basically, it's just the circumstances. But, yeah, eventually I moved out of that place where I used to live. I, I am now in this place since January 4th this year. I'm really happy about it. But still, me and Steph, we're going strong. We're still making videos. I mean, today, can I talk about today's project? Yeah, sure. Today he um, decided to shoot a trailer, sort of promo video for a movie that he's gonna make. And what's it about? It's about a dream becoming reality or something? Yes, it's about dreaming what, what's in your sleep, what come and everything you paint comes out. Uh, yeah. yeah, it comes out. 
it comes true. And basically, you want to know what the crazy bastard made me do? <laughs> he made me jump on the train tracks. <laughs> As you can see, I'm all perfectly fine. I mean, I can even show my legs. I'm in one piece. Don't worry about it. <laughs> all right. Why did I show my feet on cam while there's still in my shoes? I should have done that with bare feet. <laughs> Never mind. <laughs> but this is also me and stuff. Like crazy, crazy comments, and we both laugh about it. But yeah, um, our friendship just still is going strong. We still have the same passion, and we're actually gonna work together on editing this video once we're done. And we are going to learn. I mean, I'm going to learn from him. I'm going to teach him some things I have learned. And guys, I think that's a good way to end this video. With the following message. Friends, you shouldn't look for them. But you should learn from them. Because yes, everybody yes. has something to teach you. Right, guys. This is me, the Hellmander, A.K.A. Wes, Westerton, Westmeister, Westmando. Or DJ Hell. Together with Steph, aka Power Productions, and we're gonna say we love you, you all. Know. Take care, stay safe, and don't forget to like, share, favorite, comment, and subscribe on this video. Alright? Bye! Bye.